Today, we honor relentless Rohan, his service, his sacrifice. More than a protector of Neomuna, he was a true cloud strider. He cut his years short so that the whole of humanity may thrive far into the future. Today we suffer, so tomorrow can live on. sensors. You seem terrifyingly competent. Anyway, this is where I'd usually show you around, maybe buy you a drink, but I got an incy-wincy crisis. Let me just... What? N no, no! Do not core dumb! Ah! Dumb machine! Ah, okay. Why don't you take a look around while I get to a good stopping point? This is Jisoo Calarondo coming to you once again with a special guest as part of our continuing war coverage, the Cabal Empress Keitel. Your Majesty, thank you for joining us today. We thank you, Mr. Calarondo. Most of our listeners know little of your people's history beyond your colonization efforts on Mars and the recent Red War with Earth. Tell me, what is your goal here in the Soul System? We came to your system as conquerors, Mr. Calarondo. While that was not under my rule, it is a banner I would have gladly waved. And yet you extended the offer of a truce with Earth. The Cabal say there is no road through war. Your direction must change with circumstance. Ah, you're referring to the recent destruction of your homeworld. Torah Bottle was consumed by the Hive and the Witness. And so now my people fight for survival in addition to glory. My sympathies. All of Neomuna knows what it is to lose a homeworld. I do not place much value in your sympathies, Mr. Calarondo. They were of little value to Earth. With Neomuna Civil News, this is Jisoo Calarondo coming to you today with Cloud Strider Nimbus for updates on the recent conflict. Nimbus, thank you for joining us in light of the heavy burden that has recently fallen on your shoulders. I mean, whole city's hurting right now, Jizu. Rohan was my hero, same as everyone else. But the best thing we can all do is make sure his sacrifice means something. Keep this city safe. And what of the Guardians? Have they helped maintain our peace and safety? Or are they adding new complications? We all knew the return of the Pyramid Fleet was going to be complicated. And I'm glad we had the Guardians here every step of the way. If there's one thing Rohan taught me, it's that no one survives alone. We need each other. Impassioned words from one of our city's great champions. Let us hope time proves them wise as well. This is Jisoo Calarondo, signing off. Hey, Guardian. Induction ceremony wrap up all right? The citizens did a good job improvising. Traditionally, both Cloud Striders are there for the uh, final handoff, but Rohan wasn't here, so... 
And if he were, he wouldn't be moaning about the past. <laughs> He'd be too busy cracking open the veil, jumping through the portal, and knocking the witness back on its multiple asses. You know, the Vex were working on a copycat veil. Oh, yeah. Rohan stumbled on it in the Nexus years ago. It was half finished then, but he was convinced that the Vex had the goods on the original. Goods we'd need one day. Just think. We wrestled the Veil's secrets out of the Vex and we're one step closer to kicking down the Witness's door. But first, we gotta track down Rohan's notes. So, what do you say? Help me follow in the big guy's footsteps?
Any updates? I got Osiris to help with the decoding, and... Uh, to tell you the truth, he's getting on my nerves. He keeps asking how I'm doing, giving me these weird looks, like... Uh, I don't even know what. You won't have to endure it much longer. We just got a lock on the last data packet. It's... Huh. Looks like it's inside a conflux. Oh yeah, Rohan was always tinkering with those things. I thought he was mining for lasers to stick in his gun. Okay, Nimbus, the last packet is on its... Wait, what's this pattern? 
Is this part of Rohan's notes? What's it look like? An hourglass. The notes mostly talked about a garden, so... Not sure I get the connection. Not yet, anyway. Let's regroup. We'll have the last packet decoded by the time you get here.
The Black Garden does not contain a little risk. As for this second veil to the Vex of the Soul Divisive, it was the Black Heart. Who cares what it's called? It's our chance to follow the witness! Except it was destroyed years ago. Nimbus. I understand how grief can make one behave recklessly. But you can't... Cloud Striders don't grieve. Death is just part of the flow. Ah, Guardian. Perhaps you can convince our friend that the Black Heart is a dead end. Hang on. If that heart thing is... was the same thing as the Veil, then its blueprint can be our guide to the real thing. Come on. All we gotta do is follow Rohan's instructions. He's never steered us wrong before. You're right. It's at least worth a closer look. But please, let the Guardian handle the groundwork. This city can't afford to lose another Cloud Strider. All I heard was you're right, so let's get cracking! I'll send you a list of what we need.
That's the last item on the list, and it's a powerful one. We should hurry back to Nimbus. I wouldn't rush. They're not in the best of moods at the moment. I reminded them that, however broadly they'd like to interpret the Cloud Strider's oath, their duties lie squarely on Neomuna. Not in the Witnesses' playground. So you convinced them to follow the rules? That doesn't sound like you. Or Nimbus. I have learned from my mistakes, you know. And I can see when someone is about to repeat them. Nimbus may think they're after the Blackheart's blueprint, but really, 
They want a distraction from their grief. How'd they take it when you said that? They weren't a fan of the suggestion. But they agreed to make the passkey and let you finish the job. Looking good, pal. of the soul divisive not a vex in sight all the more reason for them to stay out of the garden it has a way of amplifying such emotions till they blot out all reason so quickly and quietly now find a conceptual mind Grab its memory core and get out. The soul divisive. How did they know we were here? Focus on getting past them now. We can dwell on the how later.
made it through. Though I still don't understand how that happened. Unless we tripped an alarm on the way in. It's possible. Perhaps Rohan's passkey had a flaw we didn't see. But why not attack where we portaled in? Why let us get so far? Are you suggesting someone else stepped off the soul divisive? It's possible. It's also disappointing. Stay on task. I'll go check on Nimbus. Looks like someone beat us with a security measure. Sorry, friends. I couldn't sit this one out. I owe this to Rohan. You owe it to Rohan to do your duty as a Cloud Strider. Like you know what it means to be a Cloud Strider. in without a pass key. You know that conflux you found back on the Omuna? Let's just say those lasers were meant for more than just a light show. doing here. I don't know about your end, but they're slowing me down over here. Be careful. If the Taken are there, you're in for an even tougher fight than we expected.
I suspect the Taken have been sent to do what the Soul Divisive refused to. To cover the Witnesses' tracks. Completely. They're here for the conception in mind. Clearly, its knowledge presents a real threat to the Witnesses' plans. We need that memory core. Nimbus, wait! No time to lose. Last one to the conceptual mind is a disappointment to Rohan's legacy. As if they needed more cause to act rashly. Guardian, you have to catch up with them before it's too late. I know you feel you have to do this for Rohan's sake, but- Rohan is dead. I can't do anything for him anymore. Except to live up to what he taught me. A Cloud Strider does whatever it takes to keep Neomuna safe. We don't hesitate in the face of danger. We don't let pain stop us. We let it remind us that- You're still breathing, still fighting. Yes, I know. You shouldn't let pain stop you. But you can't let it propel you either. Trust me, that path only leads to more pain.
found this. It's Cloud Strider Tech, all right. Rohan probably ran right past this spot when he... Looking at this, all I can think of is how Rohan didn't need weapons or fancy mods. Sure, he liked his gear, but he didn't need all that to defend our city. To do his duty as a Cloud Strider. Just what I should be doing right now. You take it. Use it to get the blueprint. Meet me back in Neomuna when you're done, okay? Osiris, we caught up with Nimbus. They're on their way back to Neomuna. You convinced them? Well done, Guardian. Must be your way with words. But you'll need more than that if you're to reach the conceptual mind before the Taken. Don't forget what you're here for. We're on the move. Taken are pulling ahead. Time to really let loose, Guardian. We can't let them destroy the conceptual mind. At least not until we get its memory core.
There's the conceptual mind, and its failed creation. Or, it's God. Huh. I never really thought about that before. What kind of beings create their own God? And it's not rigid. Happens more than you think. Something to ponder after the memory core is safely in hand. Right. Focus up, Guardian. mind is down for the count. Looks like the Taken have all cleared out. Why are they fighting us for the memory core? I'm sure they were merely told to destroy the Black Heart's architect. I doubt they were aware its knowledge is the true threat. You really think this blueprint will help us with the Veil? After all, if the Black Heart was meant to be a copy of the Veil, it didn't exactly succeed. True. But even studying the failed attempt can lead to useful information. We won't know for certain until we open up the memory core, which will take some time, so hurry back. Besides, I'm sure our friend Nimbus could stand to hear some good news right about now. Absolutely. On our way. You got the goods. Osiris rallied a team of researchers while you were out. They've been itching to get their mitts on this. I knew you'd get the job done. 
Seriously, I don't want you to think I charged in there because I didn't trust you. I was just... I guess I was just after something else. Something you can't find in the Black Garden. Or anywhere else. I thought I had accepted death. That's part of the whole Cloud Strider deal, you know? Our service, our sacrifice. I'm not afraid of dying. Really. But I never considered what it'd be like to... to keep fighting when... And I know this pain is to remind me that I'm still breathing, but... How can I, when there's this giant hole where a person used to be? He didn't prepare me for this part. At least now I get why Osiris is... the way that he is. I owe him an apology. And I owe you my thanks, Guardian. Thank you... for everything. When you said you understood, I never asked why. She saved me. As <laughs> she always did. Throughout all the lives we shared, she was always my better. Just before she... She told me, don't lose hope in the darkness. She must have known what I'd find here. What was her name? Sagira. 